sweet ride. All it needs is a new pair of wheels. To test the efficacy of duct tape tires, the team starting off a little slower and beginning with a bike. Here we go. Given Jesse has built his own motorbike. Oh, nuts. Changing a bicycle wheel presents no problems. <gasps> is part of building making grunt noises? <laughs> and we are done. Wow. <laughs> Ninja skills. <laughs> We need to be methodical about how we build our tire. I've taken some measurements of a standard bicycle tire so that our duct tape tire can be modeled after it. We'll use half inch strips to fill the rim and then full strips to make the height. With the specs, the guys go to work. And Cannon has a surprising confession. I've never ridden a bike before. Don't go too fast. This isn't that bad. Ah! Oh, you're going too fast. This is pretty easy. Look, Mom, no hands. Several miles on a road to nowhere, and they have their duct tape tire. Cannon? Yes. You have a duct tape tire. Oh, yeah. But will it provide a serviceable ride? To find out, cue two comparative controls. First up, regular wheels. We've put this cup on our bicycle, and we filled it to the top with water. Go. And she's off. After each set of tires takes its turn around the course. Oh, we're experiencing some spillage. We'll see how much water's been spilled. My water is beautiful. This should give us an indication of how smooth the ride is between each test. Woo! Yeah! Finished! We started off at 300 milliliters, and now we're around 270. All right, let's swap over to rims. OK. If the myth requires a MacGyver-style save. Are you ready for this? I must be crazy. Go. Oh! Oh, goodness, that sounds terrible. Then the real gauge of the duct tape success. This is a lot more than it's last going time. Over me. Will be to see where it falls in the spectrum. Oh, she's falling! This is terrible! Between a regular tire... Don't fall! <laughs> ah! Tires are really useful. And nothing at all. We lost the camera. <laughs> and all of the water. <laughs> this is the worst! Yeah! Oh. You started at 300 milliliters, and now you're down to 85 milliliters now. Now it's time to test our duct tape tires. And out with the old, and in with the new. Yeah. <laughs> She's ready to ride. Three, two, one, go. Oh, this isn't too bad. So far, so good. These duct tape tires not only look good, they're actually kind of smooth, but they also feel good. It's working a lot better than the rims. Like, it looks like she's pedaling slower just because of how heavy they are. I don't even care how they perform. I'm just glad I'm off those rims. This is great, dudes. And success. finish. The results are in. These duct tape tires are fantastic. Rachel did pretty well with the duct tape tire. We didn't lose much water. With the rims, she didn't have much traction, so her back end kind of slid out a little bit, and that's why so much water was lost. Ah! I think duct tape tires might be a viable solution.